Good day, grade 8. Today is our Muffy 8 in health in the fourth quarter, week 1. My name is Rinaldo B. Malimban. In today's lesson, we talk about in family health. For our objectives in family health care, we have to learn how to make a family diagnosis within available health resources and the specific objectives to assist the socio-demographic, economic, and social-cultural factors to increasing the, the health of the family and to identify health problems of the members of the family. If they need to find out the immunization, health, and nutritional status of under five children, assist the dietary intake, food, and nutrition through 24 hours with all method by oral questionnaire and to make recommendations and to take actions for improving the family conditions. In the human sexuality, it refers to the whole range of the behavior associated with the psychological phenomena of sex. The human success, male and female, are distinguished by the following. The one is the internal reproductive organs and external genitalia, and also the body size muscles for the fat and percentage of the body mass in its distribution. So the human sexuality means different things of different times of life. For the babies or young children, sexuality involves learning about their bodies and their environment for observing adult behavior. In a children identify with particular gender and expectations that go along with it. Also, the adolescents involved that many changes to the development of the body structure arising from sexual maturity. The adolescents develop physical sins begin to learn the role of male and female. A maturity woman of imposal age mark the age of their reproductive years, and men as they age have to make readjustment. Now let's move on to another slide about the concepts of sexual health. In the learning sexuality from scientific point of view, will enable students to create a solid foundation on how to deal with the feelings and emotions involving the sex and love. So these are the basic concepts of the sexual health are the one is the capacity of the enjoy as well and reproductive behavior in accordance with the social and personal context. Second is the freedom from fear, shame, guilt, holds, beliefs, and other psychological factors inhabiting sexual response and impairing sexual relationships. The third one is freedom from organic disorders, diseases, and interfere with sexual reproductive functions. Let's move on for another term in sex education. So sex education refers to the instructions that provides the individual knowledge and understanding of biological, psychological, and social factors that affect one's personality and also the internal personal relationships. So in definition of sex education also is an education about sexual reproductions and human beings, sexual intercourse and other aspects of human sexual behavior. It's also about the developing your people's skills so that they make informed choices about their behavior and feel confident and competent about acting on these choices. 
next is expression of sexuality. In the sexuality is expressed both in behavior and sense of self-understanding. Why? Because physically, sexuality may be expressed through activities ranging from masturbations to sexual intercourse. And a sexual attraction may be towards the opposite or same sex. The, the gender rule that the way children perceive their gender rules will affect all aspects of their future lives, their personal relationships, and their opinions. So a home boys and girls are treated differently and given different toys and clothes. Parents treat their daughters more gently than their sons. Such as varying treatment develops character traits seen as male and female. So how do you distinguish, distinguish the human sex of the male and female? Or how can we explain the human sexuality according to the different times of life when the babies are young children or the children adolescent and also the matured individual? Now let's move on another sense in another slide all about sexuality transmitted success or STD. So what is this? Sexuality transmitted diseases is the sexist. Disease is most commonly transmitted through the sexual contact can also be transmitted by the blood, the blood products, and auto conditions. Now, it represents serious threat to the health of an individual, formerly called the venereal diseases. STD are communicable diseases which are spread from the person to person through the sexual contact. So many young people do not even know that they have STD. Often there are no symptoms of this disease in females. So a woman could have an STD and be affecting her sexual partner while not even know. So the symptoms of some STDs disappear after a short period of time, but that disease may still be in the body of the individual, it may be causing damage to certain body organs, and it may be spread to other people. So some persons with STD are embarrassed to have a test, such a reaction and dangerous scenes some STDs cause uh, irreversible damage to the body. And who gets the STD? It affects all groups and all ages of people who have sexual intercourse with a person who has an STD. Like some of communicable diseases, an STD can be completely prevented. Choosing not to be sexually active is making responsible health decision. Now, what are some common sexually transmitted diseases? The one is the chelmeti, gonorrhea, and syphilis. Another factor common is herpes simplex, non gonococcal and vaginitis and also that include genital warts ubic lice and scabies so let's talk about the one common sexual, uh, sexually transmitted diseases no? so what is the chelamity chelamity this is one of the most common study worldwide. It is an infection that attacks the male and female reproductive organs. It is caused by several different microorganisms that are similar to bacteria. 
so the Germany faction are spread to direct sexual contact with someone who has the disease. So that is all clear. Now the symptoms of appear with the month after exposure to the bacteria and they include the, especially in the male. So a male discharge of rates from the yes, painful or frequent urinations or burning around the opening of the penis and also the female the vaginal discharge of fluids itching and genital area pain in the lower abdomen bleeding between menstrual periods and the slight fever That is uh, included of one of the what you call the common sexually transmitted diseases. Now, what are some diagnosis treatment about the telemedi? Antibiotics are the most effective cure for telemedi. It is important to closely follow the doctor's instructions and to take all medicines prescribed. Self-treatment of taking someone else medication is not only ineffective but also dangerous. In the left untreated, the infection can cause non-gonococcal urethritis or NGU and a pelvic inflammatory disease. Pelvic inflammatory disease or PID is a painful infection of the fallopian tubes, ovaries, and the pelvic area. Symptoms may include the pelvic pains, chills and fever, irregular menstrual periods, and lower back pain. If the PID progresses, it can be cause scars to develop on the fallopian tubes which can cause sterility. In a male, by telemedy can lead the uh, inflammation of the pain and swelling of the sputum which can cause in sterility. Let's move on another common of the sexual transmitted disease. about the gonorrhea. What is gonorrhea? Gonorrhea is a common sexually transmitted disease in a bacterial infection transmitted by sexual fluids through the oral, vaginal or anal sex, urinary and urine test. So it is caused by bacteria that live in warm, moist area for the body. This bacteria attacks the mucous membranes of the penis and vagina or rectum of the truth. So the bacteria are spread to another person through direct sexual contact. So the symptoms may not be present or may appear within 3 to 7 days after the sexual contact with the infected person. So don't malice about this. Uh, our subject for today about health okay so we are young now in the symptoms not be presented of me up here with three to seven days it is contact of again the infected persons so in a male symptoms usually include the thick British yellow discharge from the penis may also experience the burning sensations with urinating. In a female, may have yellow grain discharge from the vagina or abdominal pain, frequent urinations, and the burning sensations with the urinating. So the gonorrhea can cause premature labor and stillbirth in pregnant women. So what are some diagnoses? and treatment. In a 
Mail Bonalia is diagnosed by examining the discharge from the fetus under the microscope. In the female culture test of vagina is examined under the microscope. Most of the Bonalia quickly and easily cured if diagnosed early. A series of shots of penicillin is the usual treatment. The culture suspected sites of urethra, cervix, ectum, parinex, blood of disseminated infections. Nucleic acid application test based on identification of nucleic acids in organism. So the treatment is the antibiotics. Insulin resistance strain to the insulin design. Let's move on by syphilis. What is syphilis? It causes symptoms and treatment. So the syphilis disease is caused by the spirochic bacterium. It is one of the most dangerous sexually transmitted diseases. It enters the body through the soft inner skin, usually in the vagina, anus, penis, or mouth. It is passed from the person to person during the sexual intercourse. One in the body, bacteria in, enter the bloodstream and infect the entire body. So the syphilis can be like threatening to an infected person. If left untreated, it can cause the heart disease, blindness, paralyzed, or insanity. So these symptoms occur within 10 to 90 days. The average of three weeks after intercourse with the affected persons. As we know that syphilis is a systematic sexually transmitted disease, STD caused by the Trimonina pallidum bacteria. So we have the three means of syphilis transmission are the person to person by the vaginal anal sex through the direct contact with the syphilis chair. Person to person during the poor play even when there is no penetrative sex or mask is common. Pregnant mother with disabilities to fetus. So what are some symptoms in the first stage of this affected person? So the first stage of syphilis is characterized by the small red Painless sore cold chair. It appears with the germ enter the body. In females are usually in the vagina, in the cervix, or in the folds of ladia. So it didn't disappear within one of the five weeks, but this is continues to develop in the body. In the second stage, the most common symptom during the second stage of the syphilis is highly contagious rust. The rust may appear anywhere in the body, and women usually appears on the outer edge of the vagina. The rust develops into the sores with a loose of clear ploy with the infectious spirochet. Without the treatment, that the second is usually passed for to 12 weeks so that is in the diagnosis and treatment and the last is from the third stage the tetiaris is usually occurs to 3 to 15 years after the initial infection so the, mo the most common symptoms are soft tumor like growth or the skin bone and liver Another diagnosis and treatment is the test for the syphilis in the blood test. The presence of spirochet in the blood or in the source indicates the presence of disease. Penicillin is the main drug used in treatment of syphilis. Okay, so that's also included on the diagnosis of syphilis. This one so you can take advantage and disadvantage of this diagnosis of syphilis. One from the history and clinical 
presentations. Second, dark thread microscope copy, special techniques used to demonstrate the disparaging shading, tile spiral structures with a dark background. So the specimen includes a posing from the liaison of sometimes by L that ends spiral. Is usually positive in primary and secondary stages and it most useful in the primary stage with the serological tests are still negative. According to Dr. T. V. Road in the section number 55. Now let's move on and our congenital syphilis. In the congenital syphilis, a pregnant woman who has a syphilis is likely to transfer the infections to her unborn child. This condition is called the congenital syphilis. Congenital means existing of or dating from birth. The unborn child can be developed as syphilis anytime after the fifth month of mother's pregnancy. The mother's chance of having this courage Exposures of human fetus that's not capable of living are four times greater if she has syphilis, and her chances of having stillborn child are double. A stillborn child is one or dead with delivered. If the baby is born, symptoms of congenital syphilis begin to appear with three to four weeks. If the syphilis is diagnosed early enough in the mother, Penicillin treatment will usually protect the unborn the fetus. This is the process. In the head, here, and the palm of the babies. You see, the congenital syphilis usually occurs following birth without transmission tea or palidum from the mother to the fetus in utero, but the unit is also infected during the passage through the infected birth canal at delivery. In the diagnosis, adequate treatment of syphilis during the pregnancy. One is more than four weeks before delivery, primary secondary early means a time penicillin G 2.4 million units or IM in single dose usually as administered as 1.2 million units in each total. Late, but then the GRI unknown duration. It's a time penicillin G 7.2 million units total administered as 3 doses of 2 4 million units of IM each as one week intervals, so on and so forth. Okay, so that is about the digital syphilis. Now let's move on about the Yori Vitis. So, what is So, 
like all studies produced is transmitted through the sexual contact so that these symptoms men not the symptoms of injury more than women do in men there are discharge from the fetus starting one to three weeks after infection males may also experience the mild burning sensation during the urination women may be have a vaginal discharge and pain in the lower abdomen. So the diagnosis, clinical, thick, creamy, sticky, discharge in diagnostic. Definitive diagnosis by gram stain or culture. Direct microscopy by gram stain. Smurfs to 80-95% speed 95 to 99% culture modified tire martin media gold steady test the sensitivity 80 to 95% from the non culture ditched from A and T since 92.96% to the speed 94 to 99% that's all about A diagnosis Let's move on another slide about the vaginitis. So what is vaginitis? It is an inflammation of vagina. It's a very common condition and affects most women and sometimes. It often caused by an infection within the vagina that causes itching or burning around the opening, opening of the is characterized by vaginal discharge, itching, or odor. Distinguished most often by wet mouth in clinical setting. Some point of care tests are also available. So this is a common cause. We have the candida, bacterial vaginosis, and trichomonas. Other causes: normal chin, planos, and medications or oral contraceptives. So the women may also notice the unusual discharge different from the normal daily discharge from the vagina. So the types of vaginitis are several types of vaginitis or three most common caused by the guest also called the monolysis non-specific vaginitis Again, we have yes infections, non-specific vaginitis, and the trichomonasis infection. So what is the prevention of vaginitis? Organism that cause vaginitis thrive in moisture. For this reason, the genital area should be kept dry possible. Wearing cotton underwear and panty hose with the cotton products below ear. Circulate and helps keep this area dry. Keeping the vaginal area clean is important. Wash only with the mild soap. Rage truly after the washing and dry completely. So this is from the women. Again, this diagnosis is we have potency. Cyclasia and 
cancer. So the HPV is the most common of all STIs. Men and women are sexually active are vulnerable to complications of HPV, including the genital warts. HPV infection is especially dangerous for women because some types of HPV can all cause cancer of the cervix and vulva. So the most genital warts growth in small uh, the tiny flower like clusters. This tribe of wet surface in between fold for the skin. Genital warts is the most often found in genitals between the buttocks. Let's move on the pubic lace. What is pubic lice? A pubic lice has been existence as long as mankind in order to Crab lice require human host. Pubic lice belongs to the antipod phylum and the Pythyrus pubis species of insects. With their crab like bodies, crab lice are perfectly designed to live the human ears. Pubic lice has shorter and wider bodies than head of body lice. They have large from the claws to the adult them to the attach onto their strands. So this can attach to the ear palisols and depend, deposit their eggs near to the base of the ear shafts. The primary symptoms of pubic lice is intense of itching. The blood stains we also notice on the underwear. Symptoms usually appear about 25 to 30 days after contact with the infected persons. So the club are usually spread by intimate physical contact with the infected persons. Clubs will be die within two hours after being separated from the human body. However, the eggs can live up to six days. A person could get lice by coming into the contact Let's move on another from the slide. Scabies. Now, what is scabies? According to my research, scabies is a common skin infection that causes small itchy bumps in duster to the tiny mites the burrow into the top layer of the human skin to lay their eggs. Sarcoptes or scabies bar Ominous Asian afflictions estimated of disaffected humans for the last 2,500 years. Why? Because God is a tiny parasite mite that burrow in the skin. They are not always acquired by sexual contact, but close body contact is a common way to transmit them. So the itching of the genital area occurs for two, six weeks after infection. So the mites can be spread to the other body's areas, especially the fingers and forearms, by touching the genital area. Hot bugs and medicated creams can cure this disease. Let's move on for another slide about what is AIDS? AIDS stands for Acquired Immune Deficiency Syndrome. Acquired Immune Deficiency Syndrome or AIDS is one of the most virulent diseases. AIDS is most serious of deadly of all studies. Millions have disease but look healthy. There are carriers can spread the diseases to others. Present there is no cure for this AIDS. AIDS is originated by the West Central Africa in the early 20th century since its discovery. AIDS has caused by the death of 
approximately 3 million people worldwide. What it means, or other the term by, by the AIDS and immune system. So the body has complex immune system made up of network cells and organ, which is can get in HIV from kissing, hugging, sharing food, and bites, toilet sets, bathing, stasis and cups, and sweat. The human of this virus lives of this body to its specially cements in blood. It's a very fragile and cannot live outside the body. For this reason, it's not an easy disease to contract. So, the cause of the age is the expect infection in the human virus or HIV, viruses such as HIV cannot grow reproduce on their own. They must invade other cells in order to reproduce. The embedded cells become virus producing the factory. So many copies of the virus are made that the cells of it are literally destroyed. With the destruction of cells, there is disease. Retroviruses such as the HIV have different chemical makeup than ordinary viruses. The genes of its virus are even more complicated than those of other retroviruses. These genes control the reproductions of the virus. Aside from that, inside of the body, HIV enters cells of the immune system, especially white blood cells known as T-cells. HIV attack are specialized helper T-cells known as CD4 cells. With HIV effects of CD4 cell, it commanders a genetic tools within the cells to manufacture new HIV virus. The loss of CD4 cells endangers health because these cells help other types of immune cells response to invading organisms. Again, what is the human immune disease is virus or HIV? It's a virus infection of progressively destroys a certain types of white blood cells called CD4. Hypothesites that cause acquired by the immune deficiency syndromes of AIDS. With the most Does not it can be produced enough the, the antibodies to fight off the, the AIDS viruses. So the macro page of usually the core invading viruses can actually housed by the AIDS virus. It contributes to its spread. The body becomes the susceptible infection that ordinarily would have been wiped by the immune response. The antibodies found in the blood people who are carriers of the AIDS virus are ineffective in fighting the virus. By the spread of AIDS, the only way to get AIDS to get the virus into your body, there are four main ways to both happen. One is the sexual contact with the AIDS virus is the found semen or vaginal secretions. Based on the studies in the 90s, this HIV spread of chimpanzees to the human. In 1968, earliest case of AIDS appeared in the Midwest. And in 1980s, start of the epidemic in the United States until now 
about this COVID-19. So you can get this HIV by sex without you know this and pass from the mother to baby sharing injecting equipment and also the contaminated blood transfusions and organ transplant so again we have spread of this AIDS this only way to get AIDS to get virus into the body we have the sexual contact the sharing contaminated needles transfusions with infected blood to blood products and the pregnancy of women with the AIDS virus women who are infected with AIDS virus can prevent passing the virus to the baby if she stays healthy as much as possible now what a positive AIDS test means so AIDS can be affect people in the several ways one is the virus carries a person can have AIDS virus is his or her body but have no signs of symptoms he or she or a carrier of virus it can be spread and disease to the other the second is the AIDS related complex by ARC people infected with the AIDS virus can develop AIDS related complex or the ARC. The ARC symptoms may include fatigue, diarrhea, presented fever, swollen slimes, nodes, loss of appetite, and weight skin rashes or the night sweats. And finally, a person infected with the AIDS virus can develop the disease. Once the person develops AIDS, he or she may live six months or long to three years. So the treatment of this AIDS, we have a, a present there is no cure for the AIDS, but the treatment available can only help relieve some of the symptoms. One experimental drug by AZT has been shown to prolong the lives of some AIDS patients. So the drug works by slowing down in the work of the AIDS virus inside the body cells. It does not, however, Read to the body of the virus from the test for the HIV to the prevent and to the threat that the people without HIV but rest for it can take the PR or F and prescribe it to the prevent getting HIV treat with people who are know they have HIV should take medicine daily to control the virus According to the this percentage of having prep, prep uh, from 18% prevention of the target target of 50% and the have HIV under control is 60%. If you compare this from the target and prevent to the treat, still the prevent is get 50%. But in treatment, we have the target 95% prescribed or prescriptions of this target. Before I leave this lesson, I give you some thoughts that health is not just about what you are eating, it's also about what you are thinking and saying. That's all for today. In your module, please answer the following activity.